Naftali Bennett. Netanyahu is out, and Naftali Bennett is in. He's anti-Palestine, and he's pro-settlements. He's to the right of Netanyahu. The Israeli military struck targets in Gaza overnight Wednesday. The Israel, the Israel Defense Forces said in a statement, citing incendiary balloons launched from Gaza earlier in the day. Oh, no! Look at those balloons! They're so incendiary. According to reports in Israeli media, incendiary balloons launched from, launched from Gaza sparked multiple, multiple fires in southern Israel. Wafa, the official Palestinian news agency, also reported the airstrikes in Khan Yunus and said material damage occurred. The news agency also reported on another site south of Gaza City being targeted and said there were no casualties from both incidents. The airstrikes are said are the first in Gaza since a ceasefire went into effect nearly one month ago. The IDF said it struck Hamas military complexes and meeting places for the Khan Yunus and Gaza brigades. The helium-filled balloons, the helium-filled balloons, which are affixed with incendiary devices, were floated into Israel on Wednesday. The IDF said the balloons were launched as a protest to the provocative flag march in Jerusalem. Big right-wing flag march, right? Just got Naftali. Netanyahu stepped down. Naftali Bennett's in there. Now you have the far right-wing fuckers. The Jewish version of Nazis, of Nazi fascists, are marching through the town saying, Debt to Arabs. This is our home. Debt to Arabs. This is our home. Jesus Christ. Yeah, after you stole it in 1948. So thousands of Israelis marched through the old city. There was this march. You got this march, this flag march, death to Arabs flag march. Israeli police in riot gear blocked surrounding streets, forcibly removing Palestinian protesters from the route or the route. Thirty-three Palestinian protesters were injured, including by stun grenade, rubber bullets, and live fire, with six evacuated to the hospital following clashes with Israeli security forces around East Jerusalem. The Palestinian Red Crescent Society said, The march was seen as the first major test for Israel's new government, led by right-wing Prime Minister Naftali Bennett. In the past, Bennett had pushed former Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu to take a tougher stance against Hamas and launch an incendiary um, and the launching of incendiary balloons, according to Israeli media, after the Israeli airstrikes, Hamas spokesperson Hazim Kassim said on Twitter, the Zionist bombing of the Gaza Strip is a failed attempt to stop our people's solidarity and resistance with the holy city and to cover up the unprecedented state of confusion for the Zionist establishment in organizing the so-called flag march. Hamas and other militant groups in Gaza did not immediately respond to here are some tweets in case you thought the oppression somehow ended when Netanyahu lost his seat. Dot, dot, dot. Gaza. Gaza tonight. Picture. Twitter. Israeli aircraft bombed Gaza just days into new government. Bloody beginning. Bloody beginning. God protect the Palestinians. And Reza Aslan, the Israeli military, said early Wednesday that it conducted airstrikes in the Gaza Strip after officials said that the militant group Hamas had sent incendiary balloons into southern Israel. Incendiary balloons, you guys. Incendiary balloons. This comes on the heels of the 11 Days War. The 11 Days War in May, which killed 250 Palestinians. 250 Palestinians were just killed. And now we just killed uh, the farmer. A farmer and three other Palestinians were recently killed. We don't know who got killed in these you know, airstrikes, who are they bombing, what the fuck, somebody released some balloons, and so they just dropped some airstrikes on who, for, to, on, for who, for what, do you even know, just indiscriminate, just bombing the population, just trying to scare the shit out of Gaza, so there you go, Naftali Bennett is to the right of Netanyahu, Naftali Bennett, in spite of having this left-right center coalition and an Arab coalition, is going to run Israel the way he wants to run Israel. He wants to run Israel to the right of Netanyahu. They allowed that damn flag march to go. That flag march, then the incendiary balloons, and now you got fucking strikes. So shit, that escalated pretty quickly. 
And, uh, yeah, there you go. So that just happened. Uh, there's an um, Israeli national flag. Let's see, Gaza unrest. Um, Israeli aircraft bomb Gaza. Support for Hamas surges among Palestinians, says Paul the Hill. Israeli military launches airstrikes in Gaza in response to incendiary balloons launched from the coastal enclave in response to the flag march, which was chanting death to Arabs. And <sighs> America, your pit bulls off its fucking leash again. America. Why do you allow this shit to happen? 